Hey guys, Iron here with a new video. Are pen roulettes a good thing or, uh, or a bad thing? I see it almost daily in the game, some poor schmuck hoping to god he is getting a juicy pen today or not, and one attempt leads to the other and before we know it he is back in tri gear and quest accessories and still no pen, only to see the next guy hit 3 pens in 2 attempts. Like how do you do it? And sadly from 60 mil an hour Mr. Poor Schmuck goes back to 20 mil an hour. Work spent grinding that for months all gone in a 5 minute workout. It's, it's like BDO has invented time travel to the past for some, for others they get instantly propelled into the future as they can't keep up getting pens to actually even spend that money. Bad RNG for these people is like missing a TED attempt. Like, like what? I had to click that three times to get it. Oh my fucking god, I, I quit. Like, could you imagine, guys? You hit two pens, then two TED accessories, and you're still quitting because you had bad RNG. Well, I, I know somebody like that. For, for most of us, myself included, <laughs> I've now failed 72 pen attempts in a row. That 10 trips back to release of video without getting a pen while Others, uh, I've seen some people hit like 9 pens in 40 attempts. I know it's really unfair, but that RNG guys at its finest. And the best way we can win this game of pen roulette is not to play it. And I don't mean don't attempt pens. What, what I mean is that you should at all times attempt it, either with crowns, like your truly, Iron Chrome 9K, I mean Iron Wolf 9K, or enhanced with backups. While, while using backups you don't lose any gear score when it goes south, you just lose your time spent getting that item, which is not as bad as losing time spent and deleveling yourself, which since you're now weaker, it will overall take more time to actually get back to where you once were. And this is the mental trap of the pen roulette. While rouletting, you're still on an adrenaline high of haha, <laughs> I'll get one, and in positive spirits. I'll I'll recover my gear if I don't get a pen, but once you just roll it two months of work out of the window and the slow realization sets in that the Black Spirit just backed up an entire 67.5 ton Abrams M1 tank up your backside, <laughs> sitting down will be uh, quite an adventure all in itself. So after this roulette with all losses and no gains, unless you have a veteran visa card swipe special anime move, it's gonna be really hard to come back from it. Especially if you just YOLO'd in your accessories. Now if you're like Ethan from Mission Impossible, anything is possible I guess, but hey, I've never seen a bad guy back up an Abrams M1 into, well, never mind. And sure, you can survive one pen roulette. Two, yeah, sure, three. Uh, I don't think I've got any friends in game that are on their fourth roulette. This is PC and console. Does that mean they don't exist? No, they, they actually do exist and there's some really tough bastards out there. But yeah. So we kind of established roulette bad, unless I guess you're into tanks. But PDO has this weird pull on people that they somehow feel like they need to roulette to quit the game. Only for them to show back up months down the road like an addict that relapsed. Just quit. Leave your gear as is and feel free to come back anytime when you feel like it. Like when they release a new class like Nova. Don't make it harder on yourself than it really needs to be. When enhancing to make progress as a normal player, please guys use backups. It's it's not impossible. I've never really taken any significant lo gear loss losses. That that made me unable to grind the amount of silver I would normally grind, and that made me able to grind whenever I feel like it instead of feeling like I need to grind to make up for the lost gains I just suffered which is a big thing the difference between playing when you feel like it or playing when you need to play a big mental mental barrier thing sure 70 pen attempts without a pen it hurts but it's not like the game is over and I'll never need to grind ever again when I hit that next pen. Is it nice? Yeah, of course it's nice to hit pens, but your next upgrade will just cost X amount more. This is video guys, it's not about making the maximum amount of gains humanly possible all the time. It really is a marathon, not a sprint. Relax, have fun, gains will come, just be smart and patient about it. Use backups when you try and don't be that guy trying to sprint the marathon. The black spirit, he doesn't have your back. Well, that's well. We're, we're talking about tanks again. Thank you all for watching. Special thanks to the Wolfpack members of my channel. Like always, super appreciate you guys. I don't know.